We have to refocus ourselves. Even in basketball, you had your little spring break, gave you a couple days off, okay, we rested our bodies, everything else, and now we gotta get focused on what we gotta do. Today until the end of next week, okay, you really don't have a day off, okay? All right, so you just focus yourself in on what you gotta do to try to go win a national championship. The 2024 NJCA Division II Men's Basketball Championship has been decided with 20 of the top teams in the country making the cut, but only one can be named champion. The South Suburban Bulldogs are the number two seed and receive the first round bye. John Pigotti has been the head coach at SSC for 18 years and brought his program to nationals 13 times. Even though his programs have been great, no team has won with a first round bye. The Bulldogs do not know for sure who their next opponent will be, if it will be Howard or Florida State Jacksonville. We're going to prepare for both teams uh, at towards the end of this week, and we're going to prepare and run a lot of their stuff that both teams run, so we're very familiar with it. And then after we watch that game, okay, we're leaving town, we're going to a, we're going to a college to, to practice, and we're gonna have a good long practice on Monday night, get ourselves ready to go for that game. You know, and then uh, Tuesday, we'll refine that when we go through, we'll have a shoot around time somewhere in the Danville area, we'll shoot around, we'll refine that, we'll refine it, watch a lot of film, watch stuff a lot in the hotel. We'll have plenty of time to prepare for them. Okay, because we're going to be, it'll be fresh in our minds because we're going to prepare for both teams. So that whoever wins, okay, we'll be ready for them. The notable stars from the Bulldogs are Chris Harrison, Quinn Hetty, and the nation's leading scorer, Jamel Jones. Some Bulldogs that are dogs themselves are Kent Wright Jr., Laquan Washington, and Brandon Adorno. They might not always have the highest scoring games, but they do drive to the basket, the glass, and the paint. Wright Jr. explains his mentality about what the Bulldogs have to do to stay on track at Nationals. Going into Nationals, really uh, keep that progression going every day in practice. I'm going to try to keep the rhythm, keep that rhythm going and playing hard with the guys, competing like we always do. You know Coach Bugatti gets on, gets on us regardless. So going in, practice every day, competing throughout the week and just playing hard regardless. So He adds about Laquan Washington. So Quan, he, uh, he came in playing hard. He came in playing pretty hard and this game has improved as you see. He started, he, at first he started off just getting a lot of layups, steals, and, and putbacks for us. But now you've seen throughout the year of progress, he's in a lot of foot team for jump shots off the glass or even in big moments when you hit him from the top of the key. So he's progressed a, a lot with his jump shot and a, a lot of defensive stops too. Washington says that the little things play a major role in the playoffs, and one of those is defense. What we got to do this uh, practice, we got to focus on our defense. Cause, and then all the little stuff like boxing out, getting loose rebounds, uh, effort plays, diving on the ground, all those plays don't matter when it's, time to, when it's crunch time. Just keep hustling, keep being there, having dog mentality, you know, doing picking up the little stuff, getting crashing off his rebounds, steals, you know, doing whatever to help my team. Brandon Adorno tells us about Coach Pagotti and his words of the day. Yeah, he says a lot. He, he always gives us a word of the day. So I would say the main word of the day for the past couple of weeks was, has been focus. So, I would say literally just the word focus, like everybody focus on what they're doing, their role, and sticking together as a team. Uh, I would say learning my role, making shots, really. And uh, my, I feel like my defense has improved a lot, so I feel like I can bring more of a defensive presence. Everyone on the team wants to win nationals at SSC, but what they do in practice will help them reach that. I know you're thinking about stunting, okay? But right now, let's work on the rest. Higati speaks about the men. Everybody has to have role players on the team, and they're role, great role players on our team. Ken Wright Jr. is our point guard. He's done a great job of getting us in all of our offenses throughout the entire year. And uh, that's his role, is to get us in our offenses and run the plays right and get things going. Brandon Adorno is a versatile guy that can play the one, can play the two, and he's the same guy that, okay, when K Kent Wright Jr. gets a foul trouble or something, getting tired, he's got to come in. He's got to run the show. So those two guys especially have to run the show and be able to get us in our offenses. If we're going to, everybody has to have a floor general. And I call those two the floor general for us. While at Nationals, the team will also be doing community service. Well, we're going to be very busy. We got to do a lot of stuff. Uh, my teams have always been uh, community service oriented down there. So we'll be doing some stuff. We'll be speaking to some schools down there, and we'll be doing stuff with, with between all of our practices, our walkthroughs, our meals, our community service stuff, everything else. They're not going to be sitting around not doing anything. They'll be 
very active in what we need to do as we continue to get ready for games. The Bulldogs will either take on number 15 Howard or number 18 Florida State Jacksonville at Danville, Illinois on March 19th. I am Claude Martinez reporting for Will Cook County News.